Welcome back to my channel and today it's going to be a video about a person that I wanted to for a, quite a while actually but oh, I didn't want this to be too controversial because I am never talking really about politics here and I'm not really interested in the subject as such to be fair it's just not really kind of my thing um, so for that reason I was a little bit like mm, are people going to treat this as like a wrong way because I really I'm really focusing here on fashion, let's call it, let's put it this way. So I'm not really focusing on who is the father, who is the, um, um, you know, connections when it comes to that. I'm really focusing here on, like, talking about women that I feel, women that I feel like they really have something to teach us when it comes to fashion. And that person um, I'm to, going to talk today about is Ivanka Trump. And obviously for some might be controversial because she is obviously a daughter of Donald Trump and I'm not going to go there. I'm just going to straight away dive into her fashion because I feel like personally, I feel like she has such a great style that it would be just a shame not to talk about her because you know of some kind of like relations, relations to her family or something like this. So for that reason, I just, I'm just i really excited to talk about her style because honestly, she is like perfection. She, um, right now, I think she's uh, 39 years old. This is like for 2021. And obviously, so she's just about to begin her life as a 40 years old woman and she looks stunning. She looks absolutely stunning, ladies. So I feel like it would be just, honestly, it would be such a shame not to talk about her outfits, about her fashion. She is a little bit, um, actually not little bit, she is classic woman. So this is going to be elegant, but very classic style. And um, something that probably a lot of like um, Queen Leticia, she's wearing very, very classic style. Queen Rania, sometimes she has maybe some kind of like little flamboyant, but still classic. So this is another lady that actually is famous for her classic style, I would say. She's obviously a businesswoman. She, um, you can see her a lot of times wearing this kind of like a business um, attire. But um, today I'm just going to show you lots of different outfits and I think like you can get inspired by her beautiful, beautiful um, style. When it comes to her, you need to remember that she's quite a tall woman. And even though she's still, um, her husband is taller than her. So when she's wearing heels, she's still like they are almost like almost uh, you know the same maybe lead, she's a little bit shorter than him but it's still nice to see that the woman who is tall it doesn't really um give up on heels because you know she will be feeling like it's just too much i i actually like that when women tall women wear heels as well and she has always wearing she's always wearing this kind of classic type of shoes so it's not going to you're not going to find her in some kind of platform or anything like this but you're going to find her in this kind of very beautiful classic type of shoes but apart from that i wanted to first talk about her outfits that she wear a lot of pastel colors that really suits her complexion and really makes her like pop you know she looks really really gorgeous she knows that those kind of pastel colors look absolutely fabulous and they give you this kind of femininity then you're looking very like soft and um, a lot of attributes when it comes to women um, what is quite interesting that uh, maybe you didn't know, she actually uh, converted her um, religion to being a Jewish um, before she married her husband as well. So there will be this kind of modesty in her in her style. You're going to see that as well, and I'm sure it is a little bit probably connected to that as well. Being um, you know being Jewish, any religion really, if you're religious, if you like um, attending some kind of uh, church or some kind of you know mosque mosque or something like this, you know, it's just always going to um, you're going to always keep in mind to be more modest, and I as well like that about her style. So even though she's wearing a lot of like a business obviously um, outfits um, as I said they are in this kind of pastel colors they are absolutely gorgeous she has this kind of clean lines everything is beautifully steam obviously she has people probably doing that for her but it's still very very nice to see a lady that is so well put together most of the time she's not going to show like I said it's there is modesty in her outfits most of the time you're not going to see a lot of skin but I wanted to mention this outfit because I really like the shape of the dress it's a little bit more fun it is still classic fun because of the sleeve there's this kind of like a boss on it that looks 
really really nice like um, more like a girlish style but it's still very very elegant very very classic and again the color looks absolutely great on her she knows her color she's wearing a lot of her colors she sometimes wear colors that not maybe are not really great for her but she still is not scared of that you know she's not only this person that she will only wear hair color that works perfect for her and that's it she likes to experiment when it comes to colors and you can honestly see her in any color there is there is this kind of a picture of her with her husband you can see she is wearing heels can't see really what is the size of the heel but you can see that he is a little bit more taller even than uh, when she's wearing heels and um, I like this dress very much, it's very again traditional, very modest dress um, shows you that she is very feminine, very again soft um, and it just have this kind of like a, it's beautiful like a gentleness, you know, I really really like this outfit and as you can see you can look absolutely great without showing everything to work, you know, and that's what I would like you to take from this video that modesty can be really big attribute for your outfits every single day. Another outfit that she is showing a little bit more legs, so it's less modest um, but still balanced because she's showing more legs, she's not showing too much on the top. Um, and obviously she has a gorgeous figure, she has a gorgeous leg, so there's no doubt about that. I like the combination of a, like a blue pink, baby pink, baby blue, sorry, blue, baby blue dress with a beige heels. This is very, very nice combination. And again, she looks absolutely great here. <laughs> she looks so many, so many pictures you're going to see. She looks absolutely stunning. She is stunning, really stunning woman and honestly, always looks perfect <laughs> she honestly looks always perfect and this you know this is so much effort to do that it's not only that okay maybe she has money she has a uh, um, connections she knows people there's people who work for her to do that but still you know there's not there's so much effort to look like this every single day it's it's very hard, not everyone is motivated. That's why there's so much problem as well about women wearing this kind of like a baggy clothes, you know, because it's not so easy to wear something like this every single day and have this kind of like, yes, I am a boss, I am, you know, I am amazing. Nobody is going to like tell me what to do. I'm a woman, I'm worth it. And I'm going to show that to the world, you know. This is not easy to do that every day. Not every woman have this kind of like a power inside. And if you have a mother and a grandmother that pushing you and they think like, yes, you can do anything. It's amazing, you know, it's it's amazing to have something strong character in your life. Like I said, if you have someone who is like pushing you to be better and better, then it's, I think it's much easier, much better. It, like it's such a benefit in your life. But if you don't have someone like this that actually motivates you every day and have like this kind of power as well that yes, you can do better, you can be better, you know, this kind of ambition, you know, not everybody has that, you know, let's just like, there's not everybody is successful because not everybody has this kind of motivation all the time. So I feel like this is something, it's not easy to be really great all the time, you know, it's, it's just, some people might think like, yes, she has money, she has everything like on a plate and you know, it's, it's everybody would like to have a life like this. I feel no, it's about as well, you know, she could be some kind of, if you have money like this, she could be a drug addict, you know, but she chose not to. She is a strong woman. She is going for her, like, goals. She wants to achieve some stuff, you know, whatever she wants, whatever, you know, it's in her, like, uh, goal list. But uh, overall, I feel like people like to judge this way that, oh, because she has everything, she has lots of money, so it's easier. But even if you have a money, you still need to have this kind of ambition and you still need to motivate yourself every, basically, day to be better and better. It's not easy to do things to be successful because you need to repeat things constantly until you get there, you know. And it doesn't take day, it takes years, you know. That's how it is, you know. So I feel like it's good to remember about this, that it's not easy to be perfect every day and it's not easy to be great woman and like achieve lots of things. It's not easy to do that, you know. But I personally don't know her, so I can't say that, you know, I don't even know like her achievement much because I didn't really do research about that. I focus on her clothes because that's what we do here. Um, and for that reason, we just jumped to another outfit that I really love. This was obviously during the pandemic, during the COVID, so you can see the mask here. Um, I love, love this outfit. It just shows you again that 
the colors are great there's this kind of contrast on the belt because it's this kind of darker like red um, the suit overall is um, this kind of pinkish um, and she looks really really good here look really good you know and it is this kind of more classic but has little bit you know extra because of this kind of like a belt on the uh, jacket and it's just perfection <laughs> when it comes to when it comes to her outfit most of the time you're going to see that the uh, dresses are always in this kind of like a modest um, length even if she shows a little bit knee they will be modest by cover yourself a little bit on the top you know so even if she shows a little bit more legs then she's going to cover a little bit on the top if she shows a little bit on the top she will cover with her legs you know so it's balanced there it's absolutely great i love this outfit because it's white and black very easy to pull basically it's just adding the belt and heels to the beautiful nice line dress and again length of the dress dress is absolutely great she looks absolutely gorgeous you could go like this to work um well it's most of the time you're going to see her this kind of more professional but very very classic you know when you're wearing something classic like this you could basically go anywhere you want you know because you are so classic that you're never going to look like you're out of place somewhere you may be going to look like you are dress up quite high when it comes to standards other people but you don't really need to compare yourself to other people you know you just want to dress for yourself for your standards you want to keep standards high for yourself not for other people to judge you because you know they're always going to judge you if you're going to wear trousers like jeans you're going to wear beautiful trousers like some kind of pastel uh, you're going to wear beautiful dress people are always going to judge you so don't honestly think about that think what is your standard and keep it high and just always reach there you know another really lovely dress really this kind of like again more modest i would say the length is modest obviously and um, wide with this kind of blue interesting design on it she looks great now she looks that's why i want to talk about her not about really about her like family or anything but about her because her style is just spot on it's like perfect it, her style is just perfect you know there's not much really room for improvement there and um, that's what i like about her that um she keeps her standards high another outfit i wanted to talk about is this kind of but what i like about this outfit uh, outfit is that with her outfits you can many times see that she is choosing those kind of little bit thicker belts you know with those those belts can be a little bit tricky because you might think about them like they are quite old-fashioned that they are not really modern nowadays we more choose those kind of thinner um, waistbands those those belts so with her outfits you can actually notice that there are those belts somewhere there like a thicker one and i think they actually she really incorporate those belts really really well and i think this outfit as well very professional very classic again modest uh, but the belt as well you can the, the belt just gives so much as well you know it's without belt i would think it wouldn't be the same and it's really interesting that maybe this is just because she's as well tall so it's just stretch her and the belt it just gives you good balance as well another great outfit i wanted to talk about because a lot of times you can hear that ladies who have a blonde hair white like they are quite bright skin they don't really look very well in this kind of dark color so black basically and i wanted to show you that there is something very powerful actually for me when ladies like this actually wearing like black suit or black dress i just feel like black is really for everyone like i know some people saying that oh black can for the light skin doesn't just work wash you out or something but i just feel personally that black can be very very powerful you can feel like really a boss or you can feel like you can do and then achieve anything in the world you know so for that reason i wanted to show you this outfit and i feel like she looks like this she looks like really powerful here and on top of that she's wearing everything in black and then mask as well in black so and you can see she has very bright skin and she has very very especially here very bright hair color so it just looks great you know for me there is no really black really can work for everyone and she's proving that here okay ladies and gentlemen <laughs> this was the video this is it for really for the ivanka trump i really feel that her style has so much we can learn from it's very very classic very modest 
and there's not many people like this dressing anymore so it's really really nice to see actually and find this kind of inspiration and motivation from her as well i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please leave it a thumbs up and um or subscribe <laughs> but also I wanted to I wanted to ask you if you have any other ideas for ladies for a classic then please leave me a note in the comments below because I always read your comments and I always try to get inspired by them as well so thank you for watching <laughs>